Is hypnosis real? It's a question that has sparked curiosity and debate for centuries. Today we'll dive deep into this fascinating subject. Hypnosis, often depicted in popular culture as a mysterious and even magical phenomenon, is in fact a genuine psychological therapy process. It involves a trained hypnotist guiding individuals into a trance-like state of intense concentration to facilitate therapeutic improvement. Contrary to what some might believe, hypnosis is not about mind control or unconsciousness. It's about harnessing the power of the mind to generate positive changes. The person under hypnosis always remains in control of their actions. The hypnotist merely serves as a guide, leading the individual into a heightened state of focus. So, how does hypnosis work? Imagine the mind as an iceberg. The tip above the water represents our conscious mind, and the vast expanse beneath the surface symbolizes our subconscious mind. Hypnosis works by tapping into this subconscious realm, enabling us to access and influence behaviors and thoughts that are usually beyond our conscious control. Recent research shows definitive alterations in brain activity during hypnosis, indicating its unique impact beyond a placebo effect. This fascinating discovery has led to a growing acceptance of hypnosis within traditional medical circles. Hypnosis can be an effective tool in treating a variety of conditions. It's been shown to help with insomnia, depression, and pain management, amongst other things. However, it's essential to note that hypnosis should only be conducted by certified professionals. The use of smartphone apps and internet videos promoting self-hypnosis is discouraged due to a lack of professional oversight. However, like any other therapeutic tool, hypnosis isn't without its controversies. One area of contention is its use for memory retrieval. Hypnosis may lead to false memories, a phenomenon known as confabulation, where the mind fills gaps in memory with fabricated, distorted, or misinterpreted recollections. It's also worth mentioning that not everyone is equally susceptible to hypnosis. Studies suggest that only about 10% of the population is highly hypnotizable. Factors such as the individual's willingness, belief in the process and level of trust in the hypnotist can significantly influence the effectiveness of hypnosis. In conclusion, hypnosis is indeed real. It's a legitimate and powerful psychological tool that taps into the subconscious mind to facilitate therapeutic improvement. It's not about mind control or unconsciousness, but a heightened state of focus and suggestibility. Whether used for managing pain, treating insomnia, or overcoming depression, it's crucial to remember that hypnosis should be conducted by certified professionals and is not suitable for everyone. So the next time someone asks, is hypnosis real, you can confidently answer, yes it is. But it's more complex and fascinating than you might think.